Let's check out the tail of the tape. And look at the weight. Goichi Yamauchi moving up to 155. He looks good at 55. His opponent, Marseille, used to fighting at that weight class. To Michael C. Williams. Bellator MMA presented by Miller Lite now. Features tonight's co-main event three five-minute rounds in the lightweight division. Brought to you by Spike Sports. We introduce the blue corner first. At five foot eight, weighing in 154.6 pounds, 70.1 kilos, his professional record 13 wins, five losses from a Porto de Ole Italia. Introducing Valerio Machea. And across the cage, fighting out of the red corner at five foot eight, weighing in 156 pounds, even 70.7 kilos. Impressive as a professional. He brings 20 victories, just three defeats. Hailing from Kurijiva, Bahana, Brazil, presenting Goichi Yamauchi. And your referee in charge of the action, Jason Herzog. Round, buddy, you ready? Buddy, you ready? Let's fight! The fight clock brought to you by Miller Lite, the original light beer. Cheers, it's Miller time. First time in Europe for Goichi Yamauchi. Against Isayo Kobayashi, he was willing to test his stand-up out. Looks like he's willing to do that tonight. His chin very, very high. Nice right hand. So happy to be done with the weight cut down to 145. Oh, did that catch him? It did. It did. And Goichi in big trouble. He went out for a second. Trying to get his bearings. Trying to get a hold on Machea. That was a great non-stoppage by Jason Herzog. He went out for a second, but he came back in time. Now he's trying to isolate the right arm. He might have it. It's close. And he slams his way out. And he's still in big trouble. Going after it again. Goichi Yamauchi on instinct right here. Machea again trying to slam his way out. But as long as he's going for submissions, he's not getting punched. And he needs a moment to clear his head. Make no mistake, he got rocked. And now Machea, inexperienced, just a year and a half in the game, trying to get through with the hammer fist. Trying to fight smart, trying not to walk into the trap that Goichi Yamauchi wants to set for him. Here's where aggression might work against Goichi Yamauchi just a little bit. And that he needs to lock down like this, get his bearings back. He's always trying to isolate the arm. And every time Mircea pops out of the armbar, he can punch him. You might want to lock him up here, use a little bit of time before going for a submission. You know, clear his head just a little bit more. It looks like that's what he's doing. You wonder sometimes, what can a heavy favorite learn? Well, now you get the opportunity for Goichi Yamauchi to take a big step forward and get that first big come from behind with because he was in major trouble. This was two or three seconds from getting stopped. Guess what he learned? Everybody's dangerous. Nice sweep! Coming out the back door. Oh, he isolates the arm. Yeah, but he, he, he can't do that Tucked until he passes there, yeah. the guard. Exactly. He's in a position where he can land some ground, ground and pound, get his senses back, because Mercea hurt him more than once. This is what we just won't know until yeah. later. How hurt is, how in this fight right now is Goichi Yamauchi? He's in inverted heel hook position. He sits back for it. But that would be dangerous. He was on the bottom. Nice guard pass. Those are the two options. Uh, he goes back to half yeah. guard. Rare mistake for him. You, you yeah. gotta think yeah. Goichi Yamauchi in his normal state, without his bell having been rung several times, is able to pass and stay there. I'm reminded of Georgie Karhani and Pat Kern. You know, Georgie texts me after that fight and he goes, Jimmy, you were, I, don't, I don't remember anything about that fight. Another pass attempt. And he slides oh, in a full mount. Beautiful transition. Mercedes is gonna kick off that fence. Not only could he win back this round, he can win this fight here. Big elbows, Mercedes doing everything he can right into the triangle. He walked right into it, trying to strip his way out. He's gotta pull the arm across. Got him! Got it. Wow, 
did it without the arm across. That is tough to do. A spectacular come from behind win for Goichi Yamauchi. He walked as close to that line as you can without going over. I mean, inches away. Jason Herzog was about to step in and stop this when he saw Goichi Yamauchi go limp, but he came back, stayed in this fight, and won it. This is one of those fights that makes you leap forward as a professional. You go back to the gym, your coach says, you got away with one. You can't do that again. One more look. The ground and pound here. Now, Mercea had no choice but to bump here. He had to do that. He had to take the risk, and he dropped right into a triangle. Does everything he can to escape. But look at it here. And that is pure triangle. That's not tension on the arm. That is pure triangle Sorry. without pulling the arm across. That's how strong and flexible Goichi Yamauchi is. Great stuff. He started BJJ at age four, and he called on every ounce of that experience to survive and advance. Goichi Yamauchi, a come from behind with. In 23 professional fights, not only had Goichi Yamauchi never been finished, he'd never really been in that much danger of getting finished. But tonight, as a heavy favorite against Valerio Mercea, he was inches away from getting stopped in the stunning upset and called on every ounce of that BJJ experience to survive. Michael C. Williams makes it official. Ladies and gentlemen, inside the Bellator cage, the tap comes by way of a triangle official time. Three minutes, 33 seconds into round number one. The winner by submission, Goichi Yamahuchi. Goichi says, this is my weight class. I am here to stay. He was put through a crucible tonight. He's with Jimmy. I'm here with the winner, Goichi Yamauchi. Goichi, you got hit. Those punches are raining down on you. You're doing everything you can. What was going through your head, or were you on instinct, man? Actually, I, d I didn't see what, what was going on. And uh, I tried to recover, and uh, you know, I have to thank all my, my family, all my coaches, to make me be ready for all kind of situations. So uh, I would tell the truth, I, I, I don't remember. But I'm here. I win. I won the fight. You said, this is your weight class. I'm here to stay. No one in this weight class is going to beat me. What's in the future for you, man? Uh, Jimmy, you know, uh, every, you, you watch all my fights inside Bellator. I'm here. I'm not here just to be, uh, uh, you know, a regular fighter. I want to be the champion. And uh, next for me, I want to face the best guys in the world and be the champion. That's it. You heard it, he has his eye on the belt. Goichi Yamauchi, ladies and gentlemen. Goichi Yamauchi, Adam Piccolotti, so many young guns in that shark tank at 155. And Goichi Yamauchi turned it around, got into full mount, and then pounded his way, forced Nejea to make this move, and then caught him in the triangle. Spectacular come from behind win for Goichi Yamauchi.